Hello friends, this is Jennifer Cherry and welcome to my channel. I make immigration, travel updates and process in going to the Philippines video. So if that is something you're interested in, uh, check my channel and consider subscribing. So we have another video. So this video will talk about swab testing or COVID test. So as you all probably know, uh, COVID test is mandatory for all arriving passengers in the Philippines. Whether you are a Filipino or a foreign national, an adult or a child, you have to undergo the COVID test. So that is the law in the Philippines. Now, I know that some of you have questions about the swab test. So in this video, we'll answer those questions including the questions or the answers to the questions how much is the swab test and how long will it take to get the results back so without further ado let's start so there are two rt-pcr test providers at the international airport for non-ofw's so the first one is the philippine airlines uh, laboratory that the toxic care and the second one is the Philippine Airport Diagnostic Lab or the PAD Lab. So let's get to know these uh, providers and let's find out who are uh, allowed to avail their services and how much. So let's go, let's first talk about the Philippine Airlines Detoxicare Private Testing Centers. So for this test, you have to pay 4,000 pesos. So before this was 4,500, but good news, uh, just starting October 16, they reduced the price to 4,000 pesos per person. So whether it is a child or an adult, it's the same price, it's 4,000 pesos. So uh, what are the payment methods? So you may pay in cash, Philippine peso or US dollars. You may pay by credit card or debit card, Gcash or Globe Cash. Um, PayPal, WeChat Pay, or Alipay. And ATMs are also available inside the terminal. So, how long is the waiting time for this if you are uh, availing the service of the Philippine Airlines Detoxicare? So, you are expecting your COVID test result to come out within 24 hours. So, within the day, you will expect your result. Now, how to avail? So this uh, testing, the Detoxicare private testing is exclusive for PAL passengers only. So if you are not a Philippine airline passenger, you cannot avail their service. But if you are a PAL passenger, you have to avail their service. That's your only, only choice. So 4,000 pesos within 24 hours for PAL passengers. Now for this, you have to pre-register. So there is a link here. So at https double slash bit dot ly slash three double f o a i k. Now I will put the link in the description box. So if you're a PAL passenger, uh, you should already know this and you have to pre-register uh, at least three days before your flight. Now how will you get the results? Uh, so the results, your result will be sent via email. So make sure that when you fill up the registration for the case investigation form for that link I showed, you have to put an email that you can access. So I would say the email that's logged in on your phone because that's very accessible for you to check. So and also notification, Will also you will also receive a text message by SMS if you put in your um, Philippine number in the pre-registration and it will say that your test result is ready so the location of the detoxic air testing center is at the arrival uh, international arri arrival area terminal 2 okay so that is the Philippine Airlines, the toxic air for PAL passengers only. So what if you're not a PAL passenger and you are non 
OFW, what is your choice? So, this is where the PAD lab comes. So, the Philippine Airport Diagnostic Lab, this is our second private testing laboratory for non-OFWs. So, for this one, it's basically the more money you pay, the less waiting time. So, they have, they have three uh, offerings. The first one is the routine RT-PCR. So, this one you have to pay 4,000 pesos and the result will come within 48 hours. So, within two days. So, the regular RT-PCR test used swabs for the nose or throat with results made available within 24 hours from testing. The next option we have is the STAT RT-PCR, which is worth 7,000 pesos. So this that RT-PCR test use swabs for nose and throat with results made available within 24 hours from testing. So within one day, you can expect your result uh, if you are going to avail the 7,000 pesos RT-PCR result. The next we have is the express RT-PCR results. And this one is within 12 hours. So less than a day, you can expect your RT-PCR result. So this one is will cost you 10,000 pesos, medyo mahal, a bit pricey. So this is $10,000, I mean 10,000 pesos within 12 hours. So this is called the Express RT-PCR. So you can expect your result within 12 hours from testing. Now, take note that even if you avail for this Express within 12 hours, it doesn't mean that you can stay at the airport. The Manila International Airport Management requires everybody to go and quarantine at the hotel. You cannot stay at the airport because they have to, other passengers will arrive there and they have to practice social distancing. And even if you think about it, anyone could have COVID at the airport. It's one of the riskiest places to be in. To, get, to catch the COVID. So according to the government advice, even if that your PCR result is expected within 12 hours, you must quarantine. But I know some people who stayed at the airport and waited for their test result. That's their option, but it's not advisable. Now let's continue. So how to avail for the PAD lab testing? So this is open for non-OFWs who are not PAL passengers. So anyone who is not a Philippine airline passenger, say you're a Cathay Pacific passenger, a Qantas passenger, you're a Delta Airlines passenger, or you are a United Airlines passenger, you can avail for their service. Now, you have to pre-register or if you can't, Pre-registration is not mandatory. You can do that at the airport. But if you want to save some time, you know, at the airport, you can pre-register. So the link is here. It's at https double slash triple w dot padlab dot ph slash dls dash slash passenger cif. Don't worry because I will put this link in the description box. So that's padlab. Now, the payment method. So, you can use US dollars or you can pay by Philippine peso. You can also use your credit card and debit card. And next is, again, ATM machines are available at the airport. Next, we have the results. So, the results will be sent to your nominated email address. So, um, in the registration or the pre-registration you made where you have to fill in your email address, that's where you are going to receive your results. So make sure that the email address that you put in the registration forms is active, is accessible. Okay. And don't worry because in the quarantine hotel, there will be Wi-Fi. So then you can check your result while you're in quarantine. Now for quarantine hotels, you can check my channel. I already made a video for that. And if you want to check the complete list of quarantine hotels accredited by the Department of Health, um, I will also put the link in the description box so you can check. So there's lots of um, so, uh, information you can check in the description box. So the Philippine Airport Diagnostic Lab or PAD Lab are found in the international arrival area of Terminal 1 and Terminal 3. So as you may probably notice now, 
the Philippine Airlines testing and PadLab are in different terminals. So, and also, if you have any follow-ups to the Philippine Airport Diagnostic Lab, let's say that you're expecting your result in 20, within 24 hours and it hasn't arrived yet, you can message or follow up on their Facebook page. You can message them or send an email at phairportlaboratory at gmail.com. So they're very easy to find on Facebook. Just put in Philippine Airport Diagnostic Lab and you will find them. So that is the end of our video. So in summary, we have two private testing laboratories for non-OFWs. The first one is the Philippine Airlines Detoxicare private testing, which is only for their passengers, only for PAL passengers. And the next one is the PAD lab, which is available for all non-OFWs who are not passengers of Philippine Airlines. And I will also put the link the links of these uh, private testing centers for pre-registration on the description box so you can check. Now, this is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you again. Yeah, if you have any questions, hit them on the comment box and I will try my best to answer them. So, thank you so much and I hope you have a safe trip and be safe. Bye!